out here seven miles. This don't make no sense. Detroit entrepreneur and musical artist Crisby Boy was on the way home from the studio late Sunday night into Monday morning when he saw this. Donuts and drifting at the intersection of Seven Mile and Greenfield. We was there, and then I so saw we parked at Coney Island. I got out the car, started filming, and I'm looking, I'm like, man, this is crazy. They're just going, they're just going, they're just going. He immediately hit record on his cell phone. This video now going viral. This all happened at a busy intersection, just feet from a gas station. They do terrible things. You know. A lot of stuff goes on out here. That's a whole bunch of nonsense. I need to chill out with that. Detroit officers did not try to intervene. Their commander praising them for how they handled the situation. The objective here is to disperse and disband the group safely because we had experience before where uh, cars have been pursued, people have been killed, accidents, maimed, so we don't want that, especially in a holiday season. Investigators say many of the drivers who do this are actually from outside of Detroit, now working to figure out who's responsible so they can be held accountable. We have since identified uh, the owner of the White Challenger and uh, we'll be pursuing a warrant after that individual and to uh, execute a search warrant at his home and seize the car. And in the midst of it all, one of the spectators accidentally hit a police car with her vehicle. A minor crash, no injuries. And no one got hurt, thank God. But they had a, a nice little crowd out there, you know. But to be so cold, it was everybody out there, you know, so. It was cold. <laughs> On Detroit's west side, Camila Mary, Fox 2 News.